Hi everyone, this is an update for my Bird of Paradise and I will show you why it has been a challenge to get her um, updated. So this is what she looks like now. I know, she is a beautiful grower. So this is what she looks like and she is just magnificent. Look at that. So that is an east facing window right there. That's a window and I always talk about that particular window. Um, so let's get a little close up. So I believe when I first got this, this might have been one of the leaves. I could be wrong because it did break when I first got it. There have been younger leaves, uh, there have been older leaves and the leaves that it came with that I've had to get rid of. Um, and that that's one of them right there that I need to get rid of soon. And I wanted to, to put that there just so you know, you guys can see that it's not always perfect sometimes. And there was a time when I was away and nobody took care of this plant. So um, it will definitely show you why that is. That's that's the sign of being underwatered right there. Um, so this is another sign of being underwatered when the, when the edges or tips are dry or wilted that's underwatering and that right there that can also happen right there um so this is what it looks like and so far there has no flowers there's no flowers for it it's just really giant leaves i have been a little bit concerned about this particular plant because i do have the fan on so you guys can see and i do like the fan on here i've had to turn this plant and move it a little bit because before like it was beating this plant this leaf right here see those that was hit by the um by the fan so i had to move it a little bit um so that's what it looks like and as you can see there is a plant light right here that's one of my plant lights so i'm having some issues on how to get this plant i might have to move the plant light a little bit but i wanted to show you the current setup before i do anything else so i water this once a week yes once a week with or without the plant light because of how big the plant is and does re because of the number of leaves it does need a lot of water to um, give nutrients to the plant itself all of the uh, fertilizer or nutrients that I do provide will be in the description section including the type of soil that I have used for this particular plant that is I believe a 12 inch pot um, if it's not a 16 inch, I apologize. I haven't transplanted this plant in, oh, maybe ever since I got it. And I think this is like a couple years old now. If you haven't seen the first vlog for this one or even the unboxing, check it out because you can see now how much it has grown since I got it. And I do not spritz this plant. It's a very low maintenance plant. If you are looking for a... Um, a plant that is low maintenance you don't need much to do just water once a week maybe um, yeah just check it once a week you know just water and that's it this would I would suggest this I would also also check though if you have a west facing window um, when I put this in a west facing window the leaves did burn so I would suggest if you have a ton of east facing window do that south this will definitely die so don't put it in a south facing window even if it has obstructions in the front or even if it if it's away from the window because of that midday sun this can only tolerate the morning light uh and i am in the northwest hemisphere i'm in the u.s and this is what she is look at how humongous she is just look at that yes isn't she beautiful thank you everyone for the love and support and all the beautiful kind words I hope you enjoyed my update. Uh, you're going to hit the like button. And of course, if you want to, for updates, subscribe. Again, all my social media accounts are in the description section. So I do hope that you will want to connect. Everything that I use for this plant, equipment, um, plant food, everything will be in the description section. So do check that out. East facing window. Rule of thumb for this gigantic plant is every week that I water. Um, I do check the soil first if it is dry. And if it is dry, I would do water. I did water her today um and there you go no flowers so far thank you everyone i hope you have a wonderful rest of your day bye, bye.